after losing everything I own to the 2019 bushfires in Australia, I've rebuilt my life and plan on travelling to every continent with my Africa twin. Join me on this adventure as I rise from the ashes of my former life. Okay, so <laughs> we're in the town centre of Queenscliff in Victoria and um, it stopped raining. Yay! So we're going to go for a quick spin around down to the uh, down to the port and um, see what things are like and then try and hunt down some food because well you guessed it i'm hungry we'll spin up to the roundabout and then turn around i guess because it gives us a nice look at some of these beautiful old buildings here it's such a pretty little place um I mean, look at the old pub there on the corner. Sea View Guest House. And that was probably an old pub too once. Gorgeous old buildings and the old pub here, the Grand View Hotel, a View Grand Hotel. Bakery. Ah, that would be the Italian restaurant. Italian sounds like a nice idea for tonight, really, doesn't it? Hey, this lovely old building. The tavern. <laughs> the Bellarine Railway. With blue carriages. So it must be like a, a historic railway line or something now. Look at this, isn't this lovely? Oh, that wind is biting though. I took off all the other layers and I've just got, um, I haven't even got my um, MX layer on. I just wanted to be a little bit more comfortable to um, to ride around and have a look around town. This would be a lovely place to live. Beautiful little town, gorgeous little buildings and houses and stuff. Cafe and pizza. Oh, that might be good too. Ah, and the pub, they mentioned the pub. Oh, we must be coming down into the port. Queenscliff Maritime Museum. Look at the giant propellers sitting here. And the buoy. So, 
Oh, there's a ferry here that goes to Sorrento. Not that I know where Sorrento is, but that might be over at Melbourne. <coughs> McCarries. Wow, I probably shouldn't go down there because it does say um, boarding for uh, ferries only. But that's pretty cool. What I should have done was gone down into Melbourne and caught the ferry across to here. That would have been fun. Probably would have been quicker and warmer too. Yeah, the signs now say to the Great Ocean Road. What a gorgeous little town this is though. Very quaint and lovely. Whiskey bar. Oh, yeah. Don't mind a whiskey. Queenscliff Brewery and Distillery. Actually, let's take a quick shot up here. Look at these old buildings. We'll come back to that. Look at this lovely one. The Queenscliff Hotel. Gorgeous. This is such a lovely area. And that's the ocean, like right there. Look at this building up here with the turret sticking up from it and stuff. And the uh, and the pelican on the on the veranda there. Clark Holmes. Look at it. I mean, they're gorgeous, aren't they? Absolutely gorgeous. Makes you wonder just what's being done with them. I mean, that one does not look like it's occupied or anything. Looks like they must have been part of a hotel or something at some point. Um, and maybe by the fact that it's got a sign saying Clark Homes on it, they're being turned into apartments or something. I mean, what beautiful, beautiful buildings. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. <sighs> Absolutely lovely. I mean, there's some truly, truly lovely, lovely things here. I mean, that's for sale too. What a beautiful old pub too. Let's see if they just do burgers. Yeah, it looks like it. I feel like a burger. Rightio. Oh, couldn't come in perfect in better time because it's just started raining again. As much as I'd love to go into that old pub and the whiskey bar, it's also really, really cold. And I just want to get back and eat my burger, I think. Oh, I forgot to unclip my keys from my belt clip. Now I've got to do it with gloves on. <laughs> so.
So now I've got to go back and um, find my way back into the uh, pub. Get myself upstairs, get myself warm, and enjoy my feast. <laughs> 